Noel Ream, sponsored by CC Roofing and Construction Company. Good evening, Concho Valley. Well, a beautiful day it was. We had lots of sunshine, deep blue skies. We got the 76 degrees. You can't beat it for mid-April. 81 degrees is our average high, so slightly below average. Hopefully, we'll pick up some rainfall totals here in the next few days. Cactus West time lapse showed a beautiful evening it was. Still seeing minimal cloud cover taking place. We have a high pressure that is built in across the west and west central Texas. This will remain overhead for tonight and early tomorrow morning. Temperatures right now at 57 out towards San Angeles. 60 degrees in Robert Lee, 58 in Ballinger. Down towards our south at around, uh, looks like Junction's 58, 60 degrees out towards Menard, 62 for folks in Brady. And winds have come down significantly as a result of that high pressure building in. We're seeing some light and variable winds taking place as we speak. Winds still staying light at least for the next several hours. But take a look at these wind gusts by early tomorrow morning. Back to about 20 to 25 mile per hour winds. And you'll notice these winds will shift back out of the south, and this will allow some of that moisture to create back into the area. So as we head back into late Sunday evening, we have a developing low coming in out of the Rockies. This will eventually push down towards the south. We're talking the Texas Panhandle, eventually moving into Oklahoma. But by Tuesday morning, this boundary stalls out just to our northwest. We also have a more persistent southerly flow taking place, so the cloud cover will be there by Tuesday morning. Also, the chance for a few scattered showers and rumbles of thunder are going to be not ruled out of the equation. So grab the umbrella as you make your way out the door for your Tuesday. Putting this into motion, this becomes a little bit more uh, movement with this, so expect the showers and thunderstorms to ramp up by late Tuesday, early Wednesday morning. This continues to move out towards the south. We could see a few lingering showers as we head into uh, late Wednesday morning, early Wednesday afternoon, but the clearing will eventually take place by Wednesday evening from north to south as that front continues to move down towards the south and into the Texas Hill Country. So upcoming rain chances, we're looking at a beautiful weekend ahead, at least Monday still staying dry. Then we're picking up those rain chances at, as the upper level low scoots out towards our east We'll see maybe a lingering shower possible by early Thursday morning. Estimated rainfall totals, this could change as we move forward with the latest model runs coming in anywhere from about a quarter of an inch, maybe to an inch in some of our northern counties. Once again, it all depends on where that frontal boundary stalls out and when it interacts with that moisture as we move forward. Your forecast for tomorrow calling for lots of sunshine, deep blue skies once again, but winds will pick up out of the south 10 to 15 miles per hour. Occasional wind gusts may be 25 to 30, but you'll see those highs much warmer than this afternoon, topping out at 87 degrees and even warmer as we head into your Sunday, topping out at 90. Some lower 90s possible across the region, and then winds will die down by Monday. The increased cloud cover there as well. Rain chances kick back in on Tuesday through Thursday morning. Lots of sunshine expected for your Friday. And once again, here is a look at our winning with the weather brought to you by Parsons Heating and Air. This was four Texas Ranger tickets and a $50 gas gift card. And you can see right there on your screen, the winner this week was Tiffany Andrews. Make sure to visit ConchoValleyHomePage.com to enter for next week's winning with the weather that will be here next Friday.